what's up to my subscribers and non-subscribers who my non-subscribers become my subscribers that we're gonna talk about before I start my work LeBron crybaby James walking off the court with three minutes left on on the clock in the fourth quarter while his team losing he's using excuse my ankle hurt then you're gonna walk in front of your coach. That very disrespectful to the coach, disrespectful to the team, disrespectful to the fans, disrespectful to the organization. When you play on the team, especially your superstar, and you wanna give up, and you claim your ankle hurt, which it wasn't hurt, you tough it out, or if you can't play with it, you sit on the bench. And ride and die for your team until it hit zero. You sit on that bench and support your team. You just don't walk in the middle of the game, man. That's disrespect. No class whatsoever. And you see why the Lakers don't want to give you 100 mil, man. I see why. You show poor sportsmanship. You're a crybaby, man. You're a crybaby. If your team was winning and your ankle hurt, I bet you'll play it through. I bet, I bet you'll play it through the pain. If your team was winning, you'll still be on that court. Or you sit on the bench, support your team until the clock hits zero. But you want to leave like a crybaby because your team lost and you can't get your way. Darlaham, you're a good coach and you're a good man. You don't need that crap from him. If this is supposed to be your superstar, he's a coward. My ankle hurt. I can't play no more. I'm going to sit on the bench and support my team until the clock run up, man. That's what warriors do. That's what superstars do, man. You're a clown, LeBron crybaby, James. You're a crybaby, man.